Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Patrick Melson Show here on Independent Talk 1100 KFNX and also going out on the 50,000-watt blowtorch. Um, we've got some very special guests hanging out in the studio with us for a little bit. I saw that, and uh, quite lovely they are. Yes, well, quite I lovely. So. I have yet to meet them, so... That's right. You didn't come in before the show. I had stuff, you, you, you I normally had stuff do going that. on, man. I had stuff going on. Yeah, I get it. Well, we've got Natalie Spears and Michelle Mickens with Social Ally. But, uh, hey, Chet, let's go ahead and uh, roll in here with Natalie let's and, do it. and Michelle. So, Natalie, tell us, I mean, wh- what is your company? What is Social Ally about? What do you guys, what is it? Yeah, so Social Ally is actually, it's my passion. It's, it's, it's your uh, passion. It is. It's taken on a life of its own. And nice. It's, it's really exciting. Um, there's two parts to my business. And uh, the first part is I take on consulting clients in which I run their marketing on a monthly basis. So, you know, it's it goes out of the spectrum of social media. We're actually creating commercials for these people. We're branding them. We're creating a voice. Yeah. We're humanizing their business. We're creating custom content, graphics, et cetera, et cetera. There's so many things that we do. And Sounds so exciting, but, but, on, but on that note, um, now will you, take, uh, will you take and manage their social media for them? Yes. Or they can do it on their own. Yeah. Or you'll so, set them up to do it on their own, right? Right. So okay. uh, we, we consult on a monthly basis. Those are people with a larger marketing budget. But, but on the other side of the coin is we provide the social ally dashboard in which people can come and self-manage their own social media and marketing efforts. Very nice. That's awesome. I mean, because some people have the time or they some people are control freaks, right? Some business owners are control <laughs> freaks right. and they want to they want to have control of this stuff. Exactly. <laughs> and, it, you know, traditional marketing is extremely costly and it's being pushed aside. We're in the digital age and social media is drastically changing the way that we communicate. Yeah. And I just think that your customer acquisition costs is much lower using our dashboard and you're just hitting thousands and thousands of people. We we offer training. Training courses when the people purchase the dashboard. And now this dashboard, that's uh, that's kind of like an online portal you log into to manage all your stuff. Yeah, everything right. from one place. Yeah, that's awesome. That's that kind of stuff is uh, very helpful. Yeah, and here's interesting. Well, okay. something I just heard. Pepsi a couple years ago, a couple years ago, actually bypassed on a Super Bowl ad, and you know why? You know why, Patrick? I have no idea. (laughs) Tell us why, Natalie. Because they decided to shift their marketing dollars to social media. Now, now on that note, Natalie, how many how many dollars were we talking about that they didn't spend on the Super Bowl to the to the social media? I'm sure it's probably millions millions of dollars, right? Yeah, millions. Okay. So. Honestly, now is the time to utilize social media yeah. for your business. It's, it's the digital revolution. If you don't jump on board now, unfortunately, these small businesses are going to get left behind. No way. Yeah. And who wants to be left behind? I know. Right? <laughs> be left behind. Michelle, you don't want to be left behind. I don't want to be left no behind. No way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so the, at Google actually changed its algorithm in January, and they changed the way that search results appear on Google. So now uh, social media is authoritative content. So the way these people are going to rank on Google is if they're actively participating on social media and blogging and doing all these things on social media. And so that's why it's, it's now it's so important now sure. more than ever. Sure. And I did want to give out the website. So it's socialallyusa.com. Indeed. If somebody wants to go check that out. And ally is A L L Y. <laughs> yeah. We gotta make clear of that. That's can be a little tricky for yeah. people sometimes. <laughs> as it was for me for a minute there. Yeah. <laughs> but um, you know, and we'll give out your phone number and the website again. I can tell you're very passionate about your business oh, and I really you. like that a lot. Thank you. You kinda eat and sleep this stuff. Oh yeah. Yeah. You put I in am. a lot of hours, I bet. Oh uh, yeah. Chief cook and bottle washer over here. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Very nice. So then how did you actually get into this? Well, so about eight years ago, before the term social media ever existed, I was working for a local uh, event and entertainment type company here in Scottsdale. And my job was to promote these different events and concerts around the valley. Okay. And, you know, my job was to get people through the doors of these different outlets. And so at this time, it was a very male dominated industry. I was the only female doing this eight years ago. And how did that feel? I mean, I liked it. You like that? Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I killed it. Nice. And uh, anyway, so this was when MySpace was very prominent back then. So yeah. I taught myself a little HTML coding. And so I went on. 
I had a promotional MySpace. I didn't want to give people, you know, my personal information. So I made this kind of promotional MySpace. Yeah. I coded the back end. I taught myself how to do it all. People could go on to my MySpace page. They could sign up for what event or concert that they wanted to attend that night. They could tell me how many people they want to bring with them, etc. And I would have it automatically text message my phone. So once that happened, I would then put them on the list. And then, therefore, they could get in for free. And so... I would go out on the weekend and I would go yeah. and I would meet these people before the event or concert started. I would walk them in, make sure they were happy, and I would leave. And you know what I did after that? I decided all the people waiting in line that were going to spend this 15 bucks to get into the concert, yeah. I decided I was going to go collect every single one of those, those people's phone numbers and email addresses. Yes. And so I built a huge database. Huge. And How huge? Uh, 10 million. <laughs> <laughs> 10 million. Yeah, and Whoa. it was from other efforts too, but but that's my database and it's very big and you know, that was my passion going out and meeting and networking and and I did that for many years. Um, wow. Therefore, And after that, uh, I remember it was a Wednesday afternoon, the owner of the company, he brought us all into the conference room. Like I said, it was the only female. He pulls my MySpace page up on the screen and he's kind of like, oh, boys, look at what Natalie's doing here. And um, so then he gave me a department within his company called New Media. That's what we coined it as, New Media. But this was before social media. So I was given some interns and I kind of just paved the path as to what new media was going to look like. And uh, yeah, the rest is history. <laughs> wow, that's exciting. Yeah. So from, so you were really moving and shaking there. Definitely. And and it's a good thing he took notice. Yeah. Yeah. Very, very grateful for that. Absolutely. And after that, I was approached by a couple of friends and um, I was I joined their social media company and we did that and uh, we were doing a lot of conventions uh, there was there's different bar nightclub restaurant conventions in in Las Vegas and we would do those and so we gained a huge clientele and all the restaurants and, and venues became our clients and so first we started in Old Town Scottsdale we expanded to Las Vegas to Cabo San Lucas wow, um, to New nice. York City to, to Chicago Atlanta City so that became my niche and the restaurant and the in the concert industry and so that was what I was doing for a long time. And uh, I killed it. It was, nice. it was amazing. And um, then, you know, I, I had a tragedy in my family, so I decided to take a year off. And I didn't okay. do much. But after that year was up, I just decided that I wanted to get back into it. And that's when I started Social Ally. Sweet. So it's it's free. It's been it's been a crazy ride, and my dreams have come to life, and it's just really awesome. I'm, that is awesome. Yeah. Now, when did you form the company? How long? Social ago? Ally was started. Probably a um, couple years ago, year and a half to, to two okay. years ago. All right. And the growth that I've seen is just unbelievable. And I'm just so grateful. The type of people I'm meeting and the clients that are that are coming to me, it's just I, I, words don't great. describe. The words don't describe. Yeah, I, I can just, tell you're very yeah, excited about I this. Am. This is awesome. And so you're the founder and CEO of the company. I am, yeah. And uh, everything's going well. It's going that very well. That is awesome. Well. well, here's the deal. Hey, Chet, let's take a quick break. And then I want to come back with Natalie and Michelle because we got to get into a little bit more. I want to ask you, um, you know, how it helps the average business and so forth. So we'll Absolutely. talk about that when we come back with the Patrick Melson Show. Looking to grow your business and reach new leads? Social Ally has your answer. Social Ally is a full-service social media marketing agency for your business. They specialize in management and provide a digital marketing dashboard to end users. Social Ally's goal is to empower business owners, big and small, to utilize the branding power of social media to drive sales and create brand awareness through the Social Ally management dashboard. Social Ally is a full-service social media marketing agency for business. Social Ally specializes in managing Internet marketing, social strategy, and provides a comprehensive digital marketing dashboard to end users. With a Social Ally team of brand managers, marketing strategists, writers, designers, and techs, they can pull you in the right direction. Reach Social Ally at socialallyusa.com or find them on Facebook or call them at 480-878-5947. 480-878-5947. Social Ally is your all-in-one marketing tool specifically designed for your business. It's time to get social and increase your Google search rankings. SocialAllyUSA.com
Tell you what, you leave them alone for one minute. Yeah, we had, we had a little mishap in the studio with yeah, Natalie, right, Chad? I mean, yeah, I don't she, know what. She's flailing her hand. She broke her headset. Tears are streaming down her face. <laughs> Listen, sweetheart, it's only a piece of plastic. Oh, it's thank you. Okay. Thank you for coming to save the day. Absolutely. Yes. Yeah, so, all right. Hey, everyone, we are back with Social Ally. And be sure to go to the website, socialallyusa.com. And check out all the beautiful things they have going on on the website. They are a social media consulting company. Um, and we'll give out the phone number here in a little bit. Um, but, Natalie, I did want to ask you, so how does it help the average business owner? Are you catering to small business, medium size? Yeah, I mean, the, it's so broad, the type of businesses that we have using this. Yeah. Um, Really, I love to empower the small business owner because they can take this dashboard and it does the job of 10 people. You get as much as you put into it. And so they can spend as much time as they want to doing lead generation and all these different things on their dashboard. And so they're going to they're going to see those results just depending on, like I said, what they put into it. Um, you can actually see the results. You can. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's there's full analytics. And so you're actually seeing what's happening. You're seeing your type of demographic you're hitting. You're seeing your clicks. You're seeing where they came from. And there's so much that it does. Um, does this port does this um, also uh, analyze your website as well? Yeah, Google Analytics are actually baked into okay. it as well. Okay, yes. gotcha. And so really it's just all about leveraging your time. Yeah, it, it makes sense. It is. And if I could just talk about the dash bar a little bit, because that's what we've done is actually created this to leverage the time of the people yeah. um, that want to actually do their own social media marketing. Um, and it's a way to generate leads, engage with their customers, monitoring their brand interactions, um, just really growing their social presence. Um, otherwise, you know, they'd be sitting there logging into every platform, yeah. whereas we would just go ahead and load everything together and, and get it out there for them. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Yeah. I can't wait to try it out myself, actually. Oh, great. We're yeah. excited that you're going to be using it. I know. You I are. cannot Very wait. Excited. I cannot wait to try it out. It's going to be great. I kind of want to tell you a little bit. Um, about I have a client that uses a dashboard and she's okay. paying forty dollars a month okay. and I think she's a little bit of an interesting case study so I'd like to share that with yeah, you. Yeah, let's hear about that. So her name is Cheryl. Okay. She owns a singles travel company here in Arizona and she had told me that she was spending fifteen hundred to a couple thousand dollars on Google AdWords. And so, like I said, Google had made that huge algorithm change in January. So she was on the first page of Google. After they made this change, she dropped off to page six or seven of Google. Okay. So somehow she came across me and my website. And so she bought a training course on the dashboard and she's paying $40 a month. And she listened to everything that we said. She followed our instructions to the T. Nice. And it's, so this is so crazy, but she was on uh, page six. Within a 90-day period, we got her to the first page of Google, and it was so cool to see her. She would call the office every week. Oh, I'm on the fifth page of Google. I'm on the fourth page of Google. Sweet. And so she was listening to what we were teaching her, and she organically got onto the first page of Google. And I think that's just an awesome case study because there's so many small businesses out there that I've talked to, yeah. and I'm sure that ever someone knows someone that's spending thousands of dollars on Google right. AdWords. I mean, I've you got to shift I've your marketing that. dollars. Yeah. Yeah. So that's 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 you know that's one amazing. of my favorite so, case studies. So for forty bucks a month, you're saying? Yeah. That's all she was spending with <laughs> that's you. That's all she's spending. Yeah. Wow. Well, let me ask you this: If you want to tell us, I mean, do you have a promotion right now at all, or what? What does it cost for the average guy mm -hmm. or small business to actually get started with you? Well, Patrick, we right now with the promotion that we're running, um, if they call into uh, the office and they mention the radio station, then go ahead or, and give the phone number out. If you um, will. Our phone number is four eight zero eight seven eight. Five nine four seven. Okay. But we're what we're doing, um, especially for the um, the listeners today, is we will get them set up. We have a four ninety five package, which includes all of their training. Okay. We're offering it to them for two forty nine if they do mention the ad, and that's getting them completely set up, trained, and that does include their first month. Okay. And strategy. So that's, so that's like half off. Correct. Yeah. Two forty nine is getting you set up and trained exactly on what to do. Yep. Correct. Okay. And it's including their first month of the dashboard. So. Okay. And the dashboard monthly is how much? Anywhere from three or thirty nine ninety five to two ninety nine. Okay. Depending, depending on, on what you got going Correct. or what it is. Right. Okay. Correct. 
Um, it sounds like you guys help a lot of different types of businesses or, or who are your clients? Yeah. Oh my gosh. We have so many different types of clients. I mean, to name a few, uh, we have comedians, car dealerships, uh, realtors. We have tons of authors. I've somehow hit the author industry and oh, made wow. amazing people. I mean, we have publicly traded companies. We have internet marketers. I have, this applies to anyone. It's really for anyone who wants to leverage their time while enhancing their social media presence and quite frankly, to rank on Google because they're wasting their money on Google AdWords. Really? Yes. You think so? People I 100% are wasting their money. think so. Because there's people that believe that Google AdWords are working for them. Unless but, uh, they're spending, you know, hundreds of thousands of dollars yeah. on Google AdWords. Uh, in my opinion, I just think that it's the money's much just well spent on social media. Yeah, I would, I would agree with that. Yeah. Sure. Now, um, as far as it sounds like you got a wide range of clients, but I mean, if somebody has just a, a small office where it's almost by themselves or just a few people, same thing, right? I mean, hey, it's listen, help I started by myself. Now I have you a did? team of ten. Nice. I mean, yes, it applies to anyone. That's yeah. what the, I, that's why I'm here for is to empower the small business owner yeah. because that's me, and I want to empower all you know. Obviously, I'm a woman business owner, so I right. love working with women, too, and men. But it's just all about empowering the small business owner yeah. because that's what this does. Got to love that. It's I definitely tell you. taking the business to the next level. Yeah. Yeah. I, I like the idea. And let me ask you this. Do you have a program if somebody says, you know what? I don't even want to manage anything myself because I don't have time. <laughs> I want you guys to handle it. You're the pros. What is that going to cost? Yeah, absolutely. I have that. That kind of is, it ranges. I mean, depending on who we're talking to. So maybe you got to give them a quote. Yeah, it just, it's very custom tailored to, to who exactly we're just talking to because yeah. there's many different things that people may want from their campaigns. They might want list building. They might want fans. They might, you know, it just depends what they want, what their goal is, and then we tailor it to them. Yeah, that makes sense. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Well, it sounds like, um, you know, with your history of new media, as you call it, Social media. Yes, social media. I mean, does anyone know this better than Natalie? Absolutely not. No, no way. <laughs> Nobody does. I'm very confident that um, I've I've very strategically set myself up in a way that's very different from any other social media expert that you're going to talk to. Okay, I like that. Yeah, I like that. It sounds like you're really into it. I am. Um, what else? Tell us something else that our listeners should know. <laughs> Well, one of my favorite social media strategists, his name is Eric Wallum, and as he says, you don't have a choice whether you do social media today. The question is really how well you're doing it. Okay. Um, I think that social media, it's your customer today, it's your customer tomorrow, it's your employees, and everyone in between. Uh, it's just so imperative that social media is an integral part of any company's overall strategy. And I just hope that Social Ally can can be here on the journey to help all of your listeners. Just Absolutely. really any business owner out there, I want to be there to help because it's my passion. That's right. And I'm going to give out the phone number again. But the website is socialallyusa.com. The phone number is 480-878-5947. I'll give it out one more time. 480-878-5947, socialallyusa.com. Now, let me ask you this. When you're talking about social media, what's the best social media you want to be on real quick? I would say Instagram is the uh, the most used no way. right now. Most yeah. Used. Yeah, so you got, you got to be on Instagram. Yeah, you got to be gotta on be Instagram. On. What's next? Facebook? Pinterest, I Pinterest. would say. Yeah. Wow, Facebook's <laughs> dropping. Hey, guys, it's been a lot of fun. we got to go to the news. Awesome. It's been a pleasure. I want to have you back soon, though, okay? I'm Patrick Melson. We'll be right back. Thank after you. The news. Thank you.